Hello everyone, welcome to this video. Uh, today we will learn how to customize the appearance of terminal in Ubuntu operating system. So to do that, you have to open the terminal and notice that uh, the default uh, appearance will look like this. And to change that, you have to click on this button and then go to the preferences and you have uh, profiles this means that you can create more than one profile and switch between them as you want so you can um, this is the one that i've created and so if i set that on default you'll see that uh, you see now it's uh, different it looks different i think it's it looks much better so to change this let's go to the settings um and yeah here so this is uh, my profile I'm not going to change that but I'll cre create another one and I'll name it let's say uh, your profile and yes let's now set that as default and um, let's create a new uh, window yeah you see now it has the default settings so let's customize that the first tab in here is text and the first option is the size of the terminal you can change the uh, initial size of it when you open it then you will have it in the size that you set that to be or you can just click on this reset to change it to the default settings um, the next option is this custom font if you check this box you will be able to change the font as well as the size of it I'm not gonna touch that as I think this is um, the good setting for that uh, so yeah I don't know what this is um, I recommend that you um, do experiments and find it out for yourself if you are interested and uh, a low blinking text uh, no I don't like that so never uh, the cursor shape uh, currently uh, the default shape is bl um, block and I don't like that so I'm gonna change that to I-beam and it will look like this uh, and the other option is uh, underlined but I prefer this I-beam and uh, this cursor blinking option you can just uh, leave it on enabled or disabled and uh, this way you will be able to change this blinking of this cursor uh, so um, this is the sound setting I don't know what that will do but uh, let's go to the main part which is the color step and here we will be able to change the color the background color the text color and everything that you can think of um, the first thing you need to do is uncheck this, th this box and uh, then you will be able to customize it the way you want so let's drag this here so you'll be able to see the change now set this to custom or you will it will be set to custom uh, by default once you start changing these parts so uh, let's uh, change the background to be gray let's say now it looks better I think and the uh, text color let it be green yeah and the bold color I don't know what will, that will do so I'm gonna leave it unchecked and the cursor color now it's it's black you see it's currently black so I'm gonna change that to green and that's it I don't know what will happen if I change the text part but uh, I already have uh, the setting that I want for that so I'm not gonna change this one and the next option is uh, highlight color I'm gonna check this and I'm gonna show you what that will do sudo apt um, update update yes update and if I highlight this you'll see that um, the background is yellow and the text appears in white um, it's already good but I'm gonna change it to something else let's say the highlight color will be green and the text the highlighted text will appear in blue let's say this you see uh, I think it looks better and now the most important part uh, this is the transparency and uh, you first need to uncheck this and then you need to check this one and you can see that it's already transparent you can set the level of transparency by dragging this ball to the left or right um, if you put it to the full, um, it will be fully uh, transparent, which I don't like because I think it it will be difficult to differentiate between the text on the background and uh, and on the text that is on the this uh, terminal. So I'm gonna leave it somewhere around uh, here. Mm, what happened? I closed that. 
no problem new window and i think this looks good this much um i couldn't figure out what this part is but i think this is pretty much it because we already did a lot of um, customi customization so i think that should be enough um so this is how you customize uh, the terminal in ubuntu i hope i could help if you like the video please uh, give give us a thumbs up and see you in the next videos